Now, every week we see strange headlines in the news. Stories about things like, you know, professional toad hunters. And that's just one eyebrow raising example. Teresa Strasser shares three recent stories that have a saying, wait, what? Teresa. Thanks guys, take a breather from the grim headlines and enjoy these interesting stories. First up, you've heard of people hunting deer or wild boar, but the latest? Toads. A former vet tech in South Florida opened up her own toad buster business to help eliminate poisonous toads that hurt pets. When I have people bring their pets in for the emergency center, the dogs would, you know, I would charge them a thousand dollars. I mean, well, your dad's gonna go bite another toad again and nobody was out there to help them. In one month, she captured over a thousand of the poisonous creatures. Up next, Meghan Markle has people obsessed with her grace, her wardrobe, but the latest thing people want, her complexion. Freckle tattoos are reportedly on the rise because people are just dying to get those lovely little spots that she has on her face. Some even take the semi-permanent treatment into their own hands by doing it at home. You can see just like a light freckling. I think I might go in with a lighter color now and just do some smaller ones. DIY markling, that's not recommended, but there are pros who will do it for about 200 bucks. And the latest story that had us saying, wait, what? When you hear about someone being serenaded, you think of a man crooning for his lover. But a recent report is about a boy serenading first responders. Seven-year-old violinist Matthew Murray goes to first responders and plays them a lovely tune in order to show his appreciation. They serve us, they help us put out fires, they get into houses and save people, and when people need help, they always, they're always there. That is one sweet kid, and those were a few stories that had us saying, wait, what?